Hey guys, what's up? It's the Brushless Racer, and uh, today I'm going to be talking about the differences and comparing the two J Concepts cab forward style bodies for the team associated B44.1 buggy. Alright, so let's jump into it. Okay, so the, the differences between the two mainly is the finisher has a more style, a more of a cab forward style design. It has a taller cab and it's a little bit farther forward. And that one, and on the Punisher, it's a little bit sleeker. It goes back a little bit. It's a little bit more low profile than, say, the Finisher body. So, um, the differences between the Finisher and the Punisher. The Punisher has one main window and a longer front window. The Finisher has a shorter front window. But, I mean, it's, it's, it's more at, a, at an angle. And it has two individual side windows and um, it has instead of one drop off right there it has two angled drop offs leading to the back so that the air would kind of angle over the body and hit your wing and give you more downforce whereas the Punisher, I mean I guess that wouldn't happen as much than say a than say the finisher body so Comparing these to the stock body, which just is pretty bad, that's, sorry, that's really ugly, that was my first body I ever painted, didn't know what I was doing, but that's the stock body, it's pretty ugly, so, um, it, it doesn't put as much air towards the wing as, say, the finisher, which probably puts the most back, and then the punisher, so, um, as we set the original body back over there, we're gonna look at the finisher is more aerodynamic, I guess you could say, because instead of having a scoop right there, there's just none of that. It just goes straight over, and it just looks very sleek and nice. It has a sh this this has a longer front, and that is a shorter front. I mean, that's one of the differences. And they're both really cool bodies, but in my preference, I like the finisher body. And now let's take a differences. Let let's compare. Let's look at both of them on the B44.1 buggy. Alright, so first I have the Punisher body on the B44.1. As you can see the angles and everything. It is a little bit lower profile than the Finisher. But it does give you that sleek, nice look if that's what you're going for. And see the air would go towards your wing. As so that's what the Punisher body looks like on it. Comes around really sleek, nice wraps around wraps around the steering, it fits, it's a really nice direct fit and it looks very, it looks very sleek and it just looks very clean. Alright, now we got my personal favorite, the B44.1 finisher body. As you can see it really captures that cab forward styling and it looks very sleek and just very nice. Um, it would, there, everyone says it puts more air toward the wing, giving you a better downforce, I mean I, I'm not really sure. But that is what the finisher body looks like on it. Wraps around the corners really tight and everything. It just it just looks very smooth and clean. I really I'm really satisfied with the look of the B44.1 finisher body. So that's the comparison between the B44 finisher body and the B44 Punisher body. So if you're going for the sleek look and you want to be a little bit more more low profile, I would go with the Punisher. But if you really want that aggressive cab forward style body and you really are trying to capture just the really aggressive mean look and with more downforce to your wing, I would go with the finisher body. And with that, thanks for watching and subscribe and look forward to more videos from me. Thank you.